Hello, uh, welcome to this uh, video tutorial for the slideshow the square. Okay, uh, what we get here uh, when we open the project for the first time, uh, we have this uh, for the assets, it's where we will put our pictures or videos and also the music. I already have for this example one picture and one logo here. We have also a composition for change. It's uh, where all the composition that we will change. We have uh, here the possibility of uh, eight uh, pictures and videos and eight texts with with this pictures and videos, and also uh, one end text with the logo and one intro text. And then we have here in composition for render. Uh, Two folders, composition, uh, four placeholders. Is these three compositions have only uh, four placeholders? One, two, three, and four. And the composition H eight plus placeholders. These compositions uh, have uh, one, two. Three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Okay, these are the compositions that you will render, as I told you before, and you have the three resolutions: Full HD, HDV, and SD format. And of course, here you have all the comps. It's the comps that I use for to. With the final compositions, uh, if you know what you are doing, you can take a look and change here if you want. How to insert uh, your pictures and videos and replace the text? You came here to a uh, composition for change. You open this folder. And then, for example, we want to change uh, the intro text. We make a double click in intro comp. And here we have this text. No? And we want to change it. Here you will see uh, a text layer who say uh, change this small text. And other who say change this big text because this is what they say. You make double click on the first layer in the small text and you write your text. And then for to change uh, the big text, make the same in the second layer, double click. And that's it. When we go to uh, our comp, write your text here. And if we want to put our one picture and change uh, or video and change uh, the text, for example, in the first uh, composition, pick a video and text one, we have this, and uh, you are ready import all the pictures that you want or the videos in this case is a picture uh, you take this picture and drag and drop here over this text layer your picture or video here you see the picture is there and then what you have to do well in my case I have to resize the picture it's too big then I open the transform and I made the picture smaller oh, it's good like this and then here you will see a layer a text layer who say change this text you make double click and you write your text and when you come to the 
wenn es hier mal kommt. There is your picture, there is your text. And if you want to put your logo at the end, I have this logo here. You uh, drag the logo and drop here. And delete, of course, this text, how they say it. And here in change this text, make double click and write your website. For example, this. How to uh, change uh, the color in this project? Okay, uh, in, if we are in the project window, composition for render, composition for placeholders, and uh, we select the big one, 180, the full HD, and there we will have uh, one layer it's the only composition who have this layer, who is called color correction, this layer. We click on the layer, we select this layer, and then we open uh, Windows, Effect Controls, and for to be sure that this window is open all the time, when we make this uh, color correction, we close the window. Uh, then, as you see here, we have uh, color controllers. Okay, the first uh, control color control is uh, text. If you see, we have the text here. Uh, I will change it to red, for example. Of course, how can I do this? I can uh, click on the color, and then I will have this the normal color chooser. And I will just red for this example now. If you see it change and it changed already in all the structure. And then we will change uh, the background of the text color. And we will have another way to change the color. I will do it now. We get this uh, pick, and um, we choose one color. It can be here on the uh, project window, or here, or everywhere in the After Effects. I will choose it red, but it's the same one. Then I will get a light version, And now came the funny part of this project, because you can change every color of these six blocks. For example, square color one, or let's do it on the red version. every blocks get the color or you can do one color ish for example as you wish. It's uh, up to you. It's really not so difficult to change, <laughs> as you see. And here then you can change the color of the frame. In this case is uh, perfect. Let's do it black. I want to see it. Yeah, it's there. You see? And then 
if you see the background is uh, a degradé and you have the two colors for degradé here let's choose this red and let's choose this palette red and we already changed our project then we have uh, a mask overlay mask that we can change the value of the overlay mask to 100 as you see here we see more or we can put it in zero and then we don't have any more I like to have it in 50 and then we have also here opacities for uh, lines in the blocks let's put it 100 So one option that I give it to you I give it to you you can leave it in 50 also or in zero as you wish um, that's it remember you can define the text color the background of the text color see here the color of one or each of these squares the color of the frame for the whole construction the color the two color of the background if you want to have some lines here diagonal lines and also the opacity of this mask